Hey everyone, welcome to Wrestle Talk. Today's Wrestle Talk is on Lucha Lucha Part Two. We're gonna get right into it with Mil Mascaras, more commonly known as Aaron Rodriguez R. Manio. I'm pronouncing that wrong, probably. Do not take my word on that. But um, he was born on July fifteenth, nineteen forty-two. Born in San Luis Potosi, San Luis, Mexico. His family members are Dos Cars, who is his brother. The Sick Delico, which is his brother as well. Alberto Albatron, which is his nephew. El Hero de Dos Cars, which is also his nep nephew. Syndico. Lico Jr., which is also his nephew, and Hero de Sindelico, which is also his nephew. His ring names are Mil Mascaras, 5'11", 245 pounds, trained by Jose Hermes and Diablo Velsco, and he debuted on July 16th of 1965. His finishing moves are the flying cross chop and the flying cross body. Signature moves include the multiple surfboard variations, vertical suplex, suicide dive, scoop slam, and a monkey flip, among others. Championship wise, he's a former PWF United States Heavyweight Champion once, NWA American Tag Team Champion once, with Jose Lothrin. No. And WCWA World Titan Champion once with Jeff Jaren, among others. He is also in the WWE Hall of Fame class of 2012. He has never been unmasked in the ring, and like most masked luchadors, he goes to the great lengths to conceal his true identity and personal life. Mask Cars has two brothers who wrestles, Dos Cars and Sil. Go Delico. He has two sons and two daughters with his first wife who died in 1975, sadly, and two daughters with his second wife whom he married in 1995. His nephews are Alberto Del Rio, or sometimes known as Dos Cars Jr., El Hijo de Dos Cars, and Alberto Del Rio are the current El Hijo de Dos Cars C Hello, Jr. and Hill Joe Del Ciglio. He is an avid golfer and plays in many charity golf tournaments around the world, including annually at the Los Angeles Police Memorial Foundation Celebrity Golf Tournament. Along with pro wrestling, he is a fan of Japanese martial arts and practices judo, aikido, Jiu-Jitsu, Karate, Kendo, among others. He trained Jiu-Jitsu under Mitsunuyo Maido Suda and also trained under Professor Tatanka. And with that said, we are going to go ahead and move on to Blue Demon. Blue Demon, more commonly known as Alejandro Munez Moreno, born on April 24th, 19. 22 and sadly passed away on December 16th of 2000. He was born in Garcia, Nuevo Leon, Mexico, and sadly passed away in Mexico City, Mexico, from myocardial infarction. He was married to Georgina. Or, you know, he has one child, which is now wrestling under the name Blue Demon Jr., which was adopted. His real names are Alejandro Yunez Marino, Blue Demon, or Demano Azul. 5'7", 170 pounds, trained by Rolando Verna. Debuted on March 31st in 1948 and retired on August 27th in 1989. His finishing moves are the El Pulpo, which is octopus hold, and his championship wise, he's a former Mexican national tag team champion once with Black Shadow, Mexican national welterweight champion three times, NWA World 
welterweight champion twice, among other accomplishments. He died of natural causes, sadly. He also had a Mexican or a Mexican heritage, obviously, I was gonna say, but um he's also had an acting career as well. He's in was in a couple of luchador films released in nineteen sixty one to nineteen sixty two. He also has an adopted son that wrestles under the name Blue Demon Jr. And I think that's it for him. We're going to go ahead and move on to Sexy Storm Ocamino's Luz Maria Garcia Rivias, born on September 20th, 1982. She was born in Monterrey, Uvia, Leon, Mexico. She's married since 2015 to Johnny Gonzalez and she has one child her ring names are Julius Garcia Julius Pauly and Sexy Star trained by Mr. Lince Gran Apache Abismo Negro and Humberto Garcia Jr. and David in August 29th of 2006 her finishing move is the Swinging Fisherman Suplex. Her championship wise, she's a Triple A Reina de Reyes champion three times, Triple A World Mix Hatton champion once with Pentagon Jr. Gift of the Gods champion once and Lucha Underground champion once for Lucha Underground. Um, she married boxer Gun Johnny Gonzalez in June of 2015. She has been an episode of Natural. Do your graphics channel show Taboo. She's also had a boxing career where she um, blasts herself at a boxing event. And she currently still works for Lucha Underground. And I think that's actually it for her. We're going to go ahead and move on to Pentagon Jr. Or Pentagon Dark, whatever you want to call him. Under... The ring names Pentagon Jr. or Pentagon Dark. He currently works for Lucha Underground. And he was born on February 26, 1985. He was born in Mexico and currently resides in Mexico still. His ring names are Dark Dragon, Pentagon Dark, Pentagon Jr., Penta L. Emo, Penta L. Zero Miem, and Zarius. Born 5'11, 207 pounds, built from Grant, or trained by. Grand Apache and Sky a Day and debuted in 2007. His finishing moves are the Fear Factor, which is a pump handle half Nelson driver, the Pentagon driver, which is a package power driver, the Lanza, which is a diving double foot stomp, and the grounded hammer lock inverted arm breaker. Championship wise, he is a former Gift of the Gods champion once, current Lucha Underground Championship Tripway Latin American champion once, among other accomplishments as well. He has a brother under the name of Phoenix, who also wrestles for Lucha Underground, and I think that's it for him. We are going to go ahead and move on to our final person for this video, which is Dos Caras. Dos Caras, more commonly known as Jose Luis Rodriguez Arlania, probably announcing that wrong again, born on February 21st, 1951. He was born in Mexico. He has two children, which more commonly known as El Hijo de Dos Caras and Alberto Albatron. His brother is Milmas Caras. Sid Delico is also his brother, and Sid Delico Jr. is his nephew, and El Hijo de Sid Delico is also his nephew. Championship or finishers are the Dos Caras clutch, which is a hammerlock, head scissors, pinning combination, and the sit out power bomb. His signature moves include the La Escarla which is a grounded octopus hold, the tope suicida, and the wrist lock stump puller, among others. Championship wise, he's a former Tokyo World Titan Champion once currently with Myth with Mil Mascaris, the WWA World Heavyweight Champion once, and the Mexican National Trio Champion once with Villano three and four. He appeared alongside his brother in the film Mil Mascaras vs. the Aztec Mummy. He is the father of Luchador's Alberto El Patron, also known as Dos Caras Jr., 
while wrestling in Mexico, and Golermo also performing now as El Hijo de Dos Cars and the brother of Luchador's Mil Mascaras and Sil Delico. He has two nephews who wrestle under the names Sil Delico Jr. and El Hijo del Sil Delico. He also made appearances on Global Force Wrestling or Impact Wrestling in 2017 along with his sons. And with that said, I think that's it for this Wrestle Talk. Next week's Wrestle Talk is the Wrestle Talk I'm excited to do um, because it's going to be all about my favorites about throughout different locations in the world of wrestling. The first one, obviously, we're going to start out with WWE, but it will be my favorites part one of WWE version, and it will be where I'll be talking about some of my favorite wrestlers from WWE which include Finn Balor, AJ Styles, Roderick Strong, Johnny Gargano, and Asuka. Have a great day. Peace. Thank you guys for watching.